a career that's custom made for kids who are into computers and want to make a good living in one of the fastest growing industries. Cybersecurity expected to grow by leaps and bounds over the next few years. And Tiffany Huerta shows us where kids are getting their hands on the future. What we really want from students is for them to learn about cyber and STEM, uh, to be inspired by cyber and STEM, and then to put their hands on cyber and STEM. Since opening in August of last year, thousands of local students have visited Area 21, located inside the Techport Center and Arena. You know, our goal with Area 21 open is to have 100,000 students coming through this space every year. The San Antonio Museum of Science and Technology created a security operations center where they offer different opportunities for students. Here, students become cyber warriors. They learn how to detect, investigate, and respond to cyber threats. We teach three topics. Uh, one, one of those topics is uh, the basic things that you do on a computer, virus scanning, uh, fire, uh, setting up firewalls and so forth. Uh, we also teach the students about ciphers. So like, why would you want to encrypt content? And, and how do you encrypt content? And then we make sure that they know what a security operations center is really like. Giselle De Leon is a STEM educator here. And the first reaction they get is, wow, what's this? What's this? They're asking so many questions. Giselle grew up nearby and says this opportunity is changing lives. Seeing the tech port come in here and us with SAMSAT come into the area and give STEM opportunities for kids to be more hands-on, no pressure of high-level academia. We bring it down to them and they bring it up to us and it's just it's awesome it's a wonderful experience there are big plans for this space we're going to continue and expand our programming tiffany huertas ksat 12 news keep up to date with all of san antonio's top news weather and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below and once again thanks for watching ksat